everybody, Rick Needham handicapping thoroughbred racing on Thursday afternoon, June the 21st. And this is my Equibase Winter Circle East Coast racing report. Let's go to Belmont Park first for race eight on the card, 4.34 p.m. Eastern post time. Eight and a half for a long route test on the Interturf track. Three-year-olds and up race for an optional claiming prize of some $64,000. Contenders number two isn't Love Just Grand, number eight Ampersand, number three Rocky F, and number four Piano Star. Number two isn't Love Just Grand, a five to one shot on top, folks. Qualifies as a Trackmaster Plus Power Pony, takes a 12 level class drop, is the overall speed leader in his optional claiming field, racing at or about today's distance of eight and a half furlongs on the turf, has produced power run performances in five straight, hitting the board in each of his last three adventures. Facing better company in each of those outings than he'll face in this field today. Number 8 Ampersand, the morning line favorite, is the pace profile leader. He's posted a pair of wins in his last three outings, including a power run win his last time out. Jockey Corey Nakatani has been in his arms on two previous occasions, winning them both en route to a positive 68% return on investment in the process. Is back today for ride number three, gunning for a hat trick win. Race 8 summary number 2 isn't love just grand. Tops the contenders list today, which also includes number 8 ampersand, number 3 Rocky F, and number 4 Piano Star, 2834 in the 8th from Belmont Park. Let's go to Churchill Downs in Kentucky next for race 3 in their card, 144 p.m. Eastern post time, 8.5 furlong route test on the dirt. Phillies and mares, 3 years old and up race for a allowance prize of some $38,000. Contenders number three, Moon Dancing, number four, Miss Femme Fatale, number one, All By Chance, and number six, Gabby Gulch. Number three, Moon Dancing has hit the board in three of her four career starts to date, winning twice, including a power run win in her second race back. She's coming off a power run place finish, facing better company in her last start. Number four, Miss Femme Fatale, the morning line favorite, has won two of three in her career to date, racing at today's distance of eight and a half furlongs on the dirt, including a more than seven length power run win her last time out. Race three summary, number three, Moon Dancing, tops the contenders list today, which also includes number four, Miss Femme Fatale, number one all by chance, and number six, Gabby Gulch, 3416 in the third from Churchill Downs. Bonus long shots, Charlestown, race eight, number three, Ula, nine to two in the morning line, drops in class, the overall speed leader in this allowance field, posted a maiden breaking win in her first asking. Presque Isle Downs, race four, entry number six, Officer Mula Moo, a five to one shot, qualifies as a Trackmaster Plus Power Pony, drops in class by five units, is the speed leader in this maiden field, racing at today's distance of a mile on Presque Isle's cushioned dirt track. So handicapping from both beautiful Belmont Park and Churchill Downs on a Thursday afternoon, Rick Needham for the Equibase Winter Circle reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.